remember to keep filling up those scavenger hunt forms. We got a couple of big promotions for the winner. Warning, geodesic psycho-isolation chamber this way. Stay out. This way to the main lodge, to the kids' cabins. I thought you stopped. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's go. Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you have a lighter? Because if you lit it and held it up right now, that would be rad. And completely insensitive to me and my issues. Oh, right, right. Oh, never mind. I forgot about the whole fire bad thing for a moment. Sorry, 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 my bad. <laughs> Not to worry, my bro. Let's just pick it up from the part where I do that thing. <laughs> Why, I oughta simmer down there, Phoebe. You promised Mia you wouldn't burn any more kids. <sighs> okay. Do over. Two, three, four. <laughs> hey, Phoebe, can I ask you a question? What? Have you ever had a weird nightmare about a bathtub? Is this a joke setup? Uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. Good, because if you tell one more drummer joke, I'll plant this stick in your eye. Excuse me. I told you the burgers ain't ready. But no, you didn't. The coals ain't hot. They're not going to be done for a while. And maybe a week. A week? They're back ordered. I'm the only one back here. These things take time. I don't even want a hamburger. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? So, what do you want? Oh, that's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind with you. You can clean up. They're happy to be rid of the webs. And you can turn them in for side cards. And with that, you can change the color of some of your side powers. Like your levitation ball and what have you and what not. Well, kind of a vanity thing. You know, in my day, side powers were all gray, and we thought that was grand. We were happy just to have side powers. Ah, but you know kids these days. Ah, now here's something every young Psy cadet needs. Now with that, ah, now here's, now that dowsing rod will help you find arrowheads that are buried deep. That's where all the really valuable ones are, you know. Find three or four deep deposits, and that baby pays for itself. It costs you money because it makes you money. Now, you take that side car there, put it together with nine side cards, and you'll have yourself a brand new side challenge marker, which is worth a whole rank, you know. Mmm, dream fluffs. Delicious, nutritious, and cheap. Each one is packed with concentrated mental health. You shouldn't go anywhere without a pocket full of those. That's it for now. All right, go get more airheads and come on back. Support me. I will take out your intestines, fry them into hash browns, and sew them back into your body before you ever get the chance to try that again. Yep. It's not making the reception any better. <laughs> Drum solo! Yep. Yeah, you go, girl!
Sasha Nine's secret lab is? Secret? It's printed on your map, duh. Oh, I knew that. I was just curious if you knew where Sasha Nine's lab was. Because I do. Uh-huh. See, if you were going to make a friendship bracelet, you could maybe use this button here. Why? So you could unbutton it and take it off when you got tired of being friends with me? Who said you were making it for me? Shut up. You could use that button on your lip. How about that? Jeez. Hey, quit it! <laughs> hey, look. I got a button. Can I join your little craft club? Hey, look. I got an ugly face. Can I join your ugly club? Uh, Frankie, let me handle the insults, okay? I don't want to put you doing there. We're making friendship bracelets. You know, for our friends. Oh, ah, just ignore him, Frankie. This way to Lake Oblongata. Get a rake in your ear. Ranger Crawler. Rasputin. This 
way to the main lodge. To the campfire area. Yep. Goodbye, cool camp. I'm tired of being picked on by Bobby and all the mean kids at camp. If I just had one friend here who was nice, then I would stay. But you're all mean and no one stands up for me, so I'm going home. I'll be in the parking lot waiting for my dad, so if you want to pick on me one last time, you'd better hurry. Maloof. This must be Agent Vodello's car. Yep. Man, this thing was old when they chopped it down. Let's see. I wonder if the coach has a little jetpack or something to help him get in and out of this thing. an update for everyone. Mills and I are still broken up, and no matter how much he begs, I am not taking him back. Also, you should know that my new boyfriend doesn't like being called James E. anymore. His real name is James. Sincerely, Elka. advanced training that he does in a secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes I am. Sakes alive. Well, nice knowing you. Hey, you guys sound great. <laughs> Much obliged, partner. That's really catchy. Thanks a lot, man. Hey, <laughs> you make me chip a tooth on this mouth harp, and there's gonna be a showdown. <laughs> hey, was that you? Looking at me? Maybe you should try getting over yourself? There were a lot of other people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. Hmm, <laughs> no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. Nice. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You, tree sitter! <laughs> Careful, eh? I just got this thing in tune. peeking into a hole in the girl's cabin. I'm hiding. And I thought, oh, Nils, when will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. Uh-huh. What? I mean, 
He'd see my new boyfriend, James, staring back, and he'd be furious at Nils. Who's Nils? Exactly! And anyway, there wouldn't even be a hole because James fills my heart till sometimes I think it's gonna explode. One time, I made someone's head explode. Well, okay, maybe there's still a little hole. Actually, it happened four times. But James and I have each other now, and Nils is just gonna have to deal with it. Now they make me wear this special hat. So I don't have any more accidents. Are you even listening to me, Dogen? I hope so. Hey, Elka. Why don't you and your little goggles go poke around in someone else's private business? Yo! Rasputin, not now! Just ignore him, Dogen. He's trying to nose his way into our private conversation. But... Hey, Dogen, I got a secret for you. GPC, a geodesic psychoisolation chamber. Oh man, cool! Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six sensory deprivation tank, a hermetically sealed metaphysical hot box. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah. Put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Boolean dwarf accomplice should assault own size or larger only. While in cooler, perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hmm. 
looks like one of the buttons is missing. Call me crazy, but I have a weird feeling that that button Sasha gave me goes here. Agent 9, I'm here for the advanced training. <laughs> so what are we going to learn? Bending spoons? Burning stuff? I've been hearing a lot about head explosion. And I was wondering... Science, Rasputin. That is what we practice down here. Not parlor tricks. If you are serious about exploring the possibilities of your mind, step up to the Brain Tumbler and we'll begin. Brain Tumbler? Yes. Ouch. Yes. Ouch. 